All right. So, this is my fourth video on this stuff. Um, if you're not watching this from Walmart right now, there's really something wrong with you. There really, really is something wrong with you. Oh, there's something wrong with me. Oh. Well, I already damn knew about that. But you're still watching this video. That means there's something wrong with you. And if you ain't on Walmart, that's two against you. So, more knives. What do you think of that? These things. Always a bonus finding these things. The Gamo 10 Quick Packs. <laughs> yeah. Good luck. The stores are all going to say they don't have these. You have to just find these in the store. It's like a treasure hunt. You know, some people waste their life playing online games. I did that for like 10 years. I'm done with that. Now I play the clearance game. You now I buy all the crazy shit like this. I pay 300 for that. I have no plans to ever use that. Not that I know, because I have two. I was going to return it. I was like, eh, I really don't give a shit. Because I make so much money off this, that, and this, that I could really give a shit about that. Except that it takes up space, and that's really annoying. I haven't even sold that yet. I have two of those. 75 cents, buddy. So anyway, these things sell for like $28. There you go. So I just walked into another Walmart. As you might think, I have quite a few Walmarts around me. I believe I have a minimum 15 within an hour's drive distance from me. Anywho, I just wanted to see if they had anything special on Clarence. And yeah, they had another scope. The Legends. What is this? A Bushnell? Bushnell Legend. No, you just want the UPC. There's UPC. There's the part number. This is a, three, a 9X40. I don't know shit about this. But I do know they're selling more for 55 I think this is too much money for this scope. Because those loopholes, the loopholes are the ones that are, you know, I'm, I'm talking like I know shit about scopes. I just look at prices. I could give a shit. I guess the big difference between scopes is, I mean, they're all going to do your magnification. I guess it's just how easy it is to adjust and do your uh, adjustments in these lower value ones. It's not all that easy where the loophole is. And again, I'm just talking right on my ass. And you're still watching. That means you are crazy. And again, there's something wrong with you if you are not at Walmart right now watching here. So anyway, that was on Clarence. And these, these are the ones I was talking about like three videos ago. I said something like they're a blue water or something. And I forgot it was H2O. I've been watching these things for two years. These have always been on their shelf. And they've always been showing around $84 on the shelf. But if you... When you're using the Walmart thing, when you scan something on Walmart, you scan it to see the store price, and then you tap the item, and it'll show the online price. And these have always been showing under 84, so I knew these were going on clearance. But I didn't know it was going to take this long. But look at that, $21. This is a 10X42. Do I have any 50s? Do I have any 50s? These are all 42s. Oh, I do have a 50. Nice. All right. So... The, the, these, I believe, are the exact same thing. Just one is an older packaging. The stupid plastic packaging. But I believe they have a different UPC. Oh, yeah, we want UPCs, don't we? UPC. Hopefully this isn't opened in touch. Usually they're not because these are usually locked up. 4233. This one should have a different UPC. Okay, it does. All right. So these have the older UPCs, if you'll notice as I'm about to go over. Actually, I just cheated and looked and I'm full of shit. Well, there's UPC. And here's a 10 by 50. $25. Wait, is there ducks going by? Wow, that was only one quacker, huh? Definitely something wrong if you're still watching this. And you know for sure there's something wrong with you if you're not at Walmart watching this. Why are you sitting home when this stuff is this prices? Get out Brick Seek. Put in the UPC. Look at this shit, yo. 
you could just buy this stuff and just throw it on your shelf to just look at it up on your shelf. Why even bother using these? You know what I mean? Then again, when the world's going to shit, you know, you can use this to look out to see when the mobs of people are coming to take your Bushnell legend scope away from you. And so, you're still watching? Hey, look, there's a new knife added. Normally, these are garbage. This is your Ozark Trail. All Ozark Trail knives are going to be garbage. The only reason why I even bought this is because these are assisted opening. So if you don't really give a shit about knives and you're just too stupid watching my videos to see how cheap all the high-end, well, not high-end, mid-level, probably not even mid-level, knives are. I don't know what I was saying. No clue what I was saying. All these Ozark, I mean, if you don't care about a knife, I mean, I, I, I don't understand people with knives, why, why they think this is much... This is crap, but that one's good. Yeah, it's a different low steel, but, but but what am I doing? I'm not cutting barbed wire. What, what are you doing? And even people that have the high quality steel, all they do all day is sharpen their knives, sharpen their knives, sharpen their knives. So they really don't care what the steel is. Mentally, they don't care. Because if they owned this, they would do the same thing, sharpening it all day, all day, sharpening it all day. So what does it matter, the quality of the steel? Holy crap, I'm ranting. Anyway, so... This is an assisted opening. Uh, I have one that's already, uh, I believe one that was already open. Let's go find that one. So I'm have to open one. Where it at? Well, we'll, we'll get to it and I'll show you this, why, why these are worth it. I actually have one open over there. So anyway, UPC. And you know, I just rambled for about like five, six minutes and you're still here? There really is something wrong with you. And again, if you're not at Walmart watching this, there really is something wrong with you. And if you're not on BrickSeek and don't even know what BrickSeek is, yeah, that's three strikes, buddy. Time to tap out. Again, the Fraxy, and I don't like these knives. Because the way these are made, this is like a clear plastic on top of a felt. And if you look close, it's sticking out. But then again, what am I talking about? I don't give a crap about things like that. The reason I don't like this knife is because it's too small. My hand. Maybe if you got baby hands, you, you like it. But this thing is just too small. Not that I ever use knives anywhere. So there's the UPC because you didn't watch the other three videos. And that's why you're still watching this one. You're not at Walmart. And you're not on Brick Seeker. And there is really something wrong with you. So. And then these. two fifty. Finally, this store. At this store, they actually went through and updated all their pricing. This is the first store I saw that. They had all these in the clearance. But, you know, Walmart's, they're crazy. They, they, they have real mental issues at Walmart. They won't put knives in the clearance. Well, some won't. They insist they have to be locked up, which is just stupid. I can go over the, the cookware, uh, you know, kitchen and just buy knives. I can go into the fishing area and just grab a knife off the shelf. But these knives and sporting, I know, I know fishing's and sporting. Shut up. There's something wrong with you because you're still watching this video and you're not at Walmart. So, shh. They're just stupid. So they had these all in a huge box locked up in the clearance area where nobody could even see what was in the box. I just peered in and I saw EDC and I went and I found the dude and I said, dude, I'm buying everything in that box. And the box was labeled, these need to be hung up. So they wanted to hang them up. They wanted to waste their time hanging up stuff that has no value. Anyhow, well, there you go. Here's one of those. What do we got to seize? What is this? Uh, impulse. Interesting fact on these impulses. Let me see if I can find another one. I just noticed it the other day. There's an impulse where it's written up the side. These have a black handle. Then there's going to be an impulse where it's down here. And those have a gray handle, but they'll have the same UPC. There's your UPC. All right. There's this one. If you have not stopped watching this because I won't stop talking and then went in the comments and complained that I just don't shut the hell up, there's something wrong with you. Kuda Mini. There's the Cuda Mini. Okay. And this is the Link. Is the Link? Yeah, the Link is the most expensive one. Right now, eBay is flooded with these. That's the thing that sucks. you got to sit on these for like a year till all the other jackasses like me <clears throat> have sold out. <clears throat> and there's that. Because everybody goes on eBay and competes with each other. 
I used to do that. I used to undercut everyone. But now I, I, I just don't give a shit. Let's see how it works now. Here's C's 2. How many C's 2? No C's 2, Dino. Wow. Okay. Impulse. Okay, here we go. Here's the other. See, there's two different types. One, one's an older version. One's a newer one. This is a gray handle. This one's got a black handle. But these are the same UPC, see? So that's just an interesting fact. And did I not show the C's 2 UPC? There's the C's 2 UPC. Model. <laughs> Notice how the model number matches the UPC. Yes, baby. That's yeah, how it do. This would be another crappy Fraxion. I almost don't even want to buy any more of these. I can't stand them. I hate them. Another C's 2. That goes right there. Is this a canoe or the other one? This is a canoe. Here's your canoe. What's canoe with you? That joke is stupid, and I can't believe you are still here to listen to that stupid joke. There's definitely something wrong with you, and if you are not at Walmart watching this video, there is something wrong with you. And if you are at Walmart watching this video, there is something wrong with you. Because who the hell would even do that? Here's some more canoes. Woo! Okay, it looks like a different version of the canoe, different packaging. Let's see if there's any difference. Eh, it looks all the same. Forever warranty, whatever that means. I don't know what that means. I just don't want to say lifetime. Because then that gives an open. Right. Oh yeah, I crapped them, baby. Alright, there's more of these assisted openings. Uh, here's another EDC. EDC. Where's my EDCs? What? This is the first EDC? Oh wow. Huh. Okay. Oh, number two EDC. Here's another one of these. I don't even, these aren't even worth selling. They weigh too much. They're too fucking heavy to ship. I don't even know what to do with these. Probably just friggin' give them away. No, I don't mean you people online. Get a friggin' Uber and get yourself to Walmart. Don't ask me to send you shit. Maybe I'll send you shit if you send me a dick pic. C's two. Oh, that's the first time I've noticed this. A different, different style of the C's two, where it goes up the side. Where about the old one? Same color handles. Three bucks. Now you actually can see the the, the stickers. All of my other ones, the other videos, people are probably like, "Yeah, he's full of shit." That's not what the sticker says. Well, there it is. There it is, asshole. See what I'm saying? All right. So that's the C's two. Don't see any difference there. All right, a Kuro. Is that the first Kuro today? Yeah, first Kuro. Five bucks on the Kuro. And there's your UPC. Let's throw your Kuro there. What do we got here? Eat another EDC. Another one of these stupid things. Okay. Let's get this box out. Mr. Canoe. Another canoe. What do we got here? EDC. Does anybody even buy these things? EDC. We got a Cuda Mini. What do people do with these knives? I mean, there's so many different varieties. It's a little stupid to me. C's 2, EDC, EDC. Here's another Impulse Gray handle. Uh, C's 2. Uh, impulse 2. Where's the Impulse 2 Gray handle? A C's two, a C's two. Where the hell is that opened? C's two goes there. Oh, here it is. Here's the open one finally. And one of these. All right, so oh, my nose. All right, so let's let's show you all how this one actually works. What the hell? They friggin' they taped it to the back of the box. Oh my god. These people so annoying. Man, I wish I had a knife right now where I could I could like open this. Get this out. Seems like it's all rusted. Anyhow. Oh, this thing is all bent and everything. Is this thing broke?
So you have to, somebody bent this. You have to unscrew this off and bend it back. Oh, they put it on backwards. It's on backwards, idiots. Bunch of idiots. Or they bent it. Anyway, assisted opening. That's why these are cool. So what's so what's the difference between this and and the, the expensive link? The same same freaking knife, ain't it? So you tell me the difference. Why would you want the link that's fifty dollars over this, which is eight dollars, seven dollars? Oh, the quality of steel. Yeah, 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 I know. The quality of steel. Except all you do all day is sharpen your knives. So, what does the quality of steel have to do anything? There you go. Check that out. All right, so, uh, that's, that's the score today. What do you think of that? Um, oh, and also, I started my, um, my tooth diet today. Yeah. Oh, there's only one link out of all this. Only one Kiro. Oh, the good knife. So I started my tooth diet today. Uh, let me show you. So very good thing. Look at this, America. Oreo has gone America. America. So yeah. all right. So I started my uh, tooth diet today. Like I was saying, and. With this diet, you can eat anything you want, as much as you want, and even these Oreo cookies. <sighs> so you know it's a proper, proper dieting. I mean, how many do I want? Look at these things. They're you know, like miracles like this. And is that enough? So, you know, the tooth diet, you can eat as much as you want. So I just come in here. I, mm. I should got toothed. Look at that. Red, white, and blue. The tooth died, desecrated the Oreo flag. Hmm. You stick to this diet, you're going to lose weight pretty damn quick. I'll tell you what. Oh, I also got some, uh, I got some mocha from Costco. This stuff's pretty high calories too. I just toothed that shit. Did you see that? Yeah, you just stick the tooth in, you'll lose weight. I'll tell you what. Look at that. It's almost gone now. Just stick to it. Tooth, tooth, and tooth. That means tooth in you. And you're gonna you're gonna take some pounds off. Uh. <laughs> get yourself some knives I told you it was something wrong with me if you were still watching this yeah, yeah. for those people that need uh, me to put the UPCs into the description I just want to let you know I'm taking a shit for you too so thinking about you baby Did you just see that that boy toothed? Yeah. He toothed real good. That's the best diet out there, yo. So, you all should start toothing, too. And you can throw those pounds right off you. Know what I mean? Yeah. Toothing it, buddy. Yeah. Tooth.
No, don't spill it. Stop that. Stop! Stop! What's wrong with you? Flip-flop. Flip-flop. Yes. Flip flop. That's the wrong one. Flip flop.